We all know that using sunscreens is important to prevent skin damage and protect against cancer, of course. But the reality is that half of Americans don't use sunscreen, according to a recent survey by Consumer Reports. One in five say it's because of how sunscreen feels. Consumer Report of Marilyn Moore shows us that does not, however, have to be an excuse. Sunscreens that feel good and smell good. That's what Consumer Report sensory experts are sniffing out. There's a slight beachy aroma. Some people complain that sunscreens can be greasy or shiny or leave a white residue. I just don't like the, like the creamy, oily kind. It takes too long, it gets cakey. I don't like that. In these blind tests, the panelists rub a smidge on their arms. Rubbed in very quickly and there was very, very little residual. As for smell, not everybody likes that tropical coconut scent. I think that fragrances tend to irritate your skin. They smell bad and they're gross. Turns out there is hope for those who can't stand the smell or feel of many sunscreens. We did find sunscreens you might like a lot better and that our tests show offer good protection from the sun as well. The Aveeno Protect Plus Hydrate SPF 30 and Walmart's Equate Sport Continuous Spray SPF 30 won't leave you shiny or greasy. If you want protection with a barely noticeable scent, they say check out Pure Sun Sun Defense SPF 50 lotion. And if you like that tropical scent, Banana Boat Sun Comfort Continuous Spray SPF 50 delivers a slight fragrance of a pina colada. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News. Consumer Reports survey found that women are more likely to use sunscreen than men, 57% compared to 43%. If you still prefer not to use a sunscreen, though, you can wear a tightly woven piece of clothing and a hat with a broad brim. Some sunglasses will protect your eyes and eyelids, but you may still need sunscreen to cover exposed skin that's not covered by all that stuff. You know, she said.